Hello there guys, welcome to the next episode of this Arsenal gameplay. Um, as I said previously, it's typical isn't it that we had a full squad. Youngberg has picked up uh, a bit of an injury there, damaged heel, so that means that Parler is going to be coming in and taking his place there. But the good news is Van Bronckhorst is back in that defensive midfield role, which means that we can push Vieira back into that centre midfield, which is really good. Uh, the other good news was that Ashley Cole had that card um, revoked. Um, so we are all ready to go here against Leicester. So let's see how... We are going to take this on. Ooh, he's pushed him in the chest. That should have been a red card. I mean, that's what I think. That's what Ashley Cole and Gerard's thing was was about in the last game when they got um, when they both got a red. I'm quite surprised that wasn't given actually. They seem to be having a good go here, Leicester, though. Um, yeah, there's a gap starting to show at the top. Uh, this is a really important game. Every game's in. Oh, shit. Every game's really important. Um, oh, God, he's playing here. What's going on? Um, all right, Perez, let's get you off. Let's bring Pennant on. Let's see if he does anything there for us. Oh man, we'll be frustrated here. I guarantee it. Oh, look at this! They're gonna hold on. How have they held on? That's a poor result, you know. Campbell's a six. It's not that we're playing bad. This is the thing. It's 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 weird. The last two games, they're both at home. We've been beaten. I just feel like we're missing something. Yeah, Youngberg is still injured as well. Oh god, Henri. I'm gonna have to take Henri off. I'm leaving Bergkamp in. I'm leaving Van Bronckhorst in as well. I know I'm gonna have to take him off at some point, but I'm, I just I know from the previous Champions League group phase that I can't afford to mess around. But we have to get the three points for these home games. It becomes so important when you look at what what happened with uh, the Spartak Moscow games. They were very unlucky actually not to get through that group phase. Spartak they did very well. Right. Come on. Hey, I'm going to have to take him off in a minute, Van Bronckhorst, though. Where is he? Oh, bloody hell, look at Bergkamp. Perez as well. Christ. That Bron Van Bronckhorst is probably one of the fittest ones out there, actually. Oh, don't concede now. Oh, who's that to? To one of them. Get him. That's big. Oh, who's injured there? Parler. Um, let's bring in a moto on. Oh, fuck. In a moto for Ray Parler. See what this guy can do. There we go. Franny Jeff is. He needed a goal. He's got two to his name tonight. That's a good start. It's a good start to the group phase, that. Only concern is a bit of in the injuries with Youngberg and Parler there. Uh, Southampton away. It's it's annoying because we've lost three games and two of them have been our previous fixtures in the league. Oh, they've put they've put an offer in for him. I'm, I don't know whether just to buy him. No, oh, it's absolutely no interest to go. Sack him. Youngberg's back, which is really good news for us. Clomp again, bid rejected, 3.7. Let's go to 4. Right, Parla, right, Youngberg. Just a simple straight swap, that, isn't it? So Youngberg, Vieira, right. Bergkamp is knackered. Perez is knackered. Cole is knackered. Right, Bergkamp. Henri's back, that's fine. 
Perez. Pennant. Will Tor's knackered because that he hasn't got much fitness. All right, let's let's see if this works now. You got Ben Thatcher. That's not a bad sign. I don't know if he's on loan or not. Either way, he's quite a good player. We need to get out of this rot. Oh Christ. James Beatty. Oh, equaliser Thierry Henry. That creative spark. I just saw the words then. It's what you need. That's not what you need. Oh Christ. Right, let's and then you got Bora. Let's get the attacking on. Get in. Do you know what? That's not bad. I mean, you look at how we're playing there as well. It's not too bad at all. Um, let's change that back to attacking and short. Um, Middlesbrough at home. Jesus, it's an important game. It's so important. And Middlesbrough are such a bogey team. I think for anybody on this, I mean, when I normally play as Man United on this game, Middlesbrough seemed to be the team that managed to get a result at Old Trafford. They always were as well. When you think back to that 99 season when... United won the trout. No, he's not going there. What sanded him there? They probably need to give him a new contract just to, just to sort of say, and that he's not going anywhere. Always got to make sure you read that small print that there's no um, minimum fee release clause in it. Look at them, ten million now. No, he's class Perez. He ain't going anywhere. Keown's contract is fine. I have no issues with those contracts um, expiring at all. Um, right, so the bird comes back in. Let me just check that this is all right. Vieira, Campbell Adams. Yeah, yeah, right. So this this is we should now be seeing a better display. We should. Fingers crossed. Come on, we need to make this place a fortress. This isn't happening. I think two out of the three that we've lost have been at home as well. Perez there, that's why Madrid won him. Um, yeah, that makes it look a little bit better. And then we've got Palmer. Oh, Christ, then United away. That's going to be horrific. Come on, get another goal. I want to start thinking about Palmer. Come on. Okay. I know that we played the, the team for the whole 90 minutes, which is going to be a bit of an issue for the Palmer game, but actually the result was more important there, especially playing United coming up. Right, I do want to give him another contract here. I want to get him to 03. That's just sad, because I, I do love Bergkamp. I think he's great. Oh, United drew. That's actually a good sign. Oh, he's bid rejected again. 
Rally's contract. Get him signed up. Perez signs new deal. Bergkamp signs new deal. Good news all round. Perez, Ashley Cole, is he just exhausted? I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna rest him for this game. I'm gonna I'm gonna play the rest of the team like normal because um, I was tempted to to rest Perez for the United game, but I want to give myself a good chance in this game here as well. That's a red card. Oh, Cannavaro, he's a massive player for them. That's a massive loss. That is. Come on. Let's push on here. I do wonder if we can get something here. I might bring I might bring Will Tord on instead of Perez there actually. And watch him push up. Franny Jeffers for Burkamp, I think he's knackered. Ah, uh, do you know what? It, I mean, I know we, sh we we could obviously argue that they were down to ten men, you know, and we should have maybe put up a bit more of a challenge, but in the grand scheme of things, a point away at Palmer is not actually a bad point. So I'm not going to be too disheartened by that. Oh, De Cani is rejecting his contract. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. He could be an interesting player for us. Right, anyway, guys, I'm going to leave that video there. Please remember to hit that like button, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later.